Okay, um, just because I like the word, Italian word, arpeggio, um, I think um, it's um, either you, you, you get it or you don't. What I do is I, I sweep pick the strings. Uh, an arpeggio is basically a broken chord. If you wrote a new uh, punk song, you know, and my mother was a horse, you call it, and so and you break down this chord, you have an arpeggio, okay? This is not a really cool sweep picking arpeggio, um, but uh, it's good to start with a clean sound, and I'd like to say that because I could run before I could walk, I'm left-handed, I said, uh, showing my right hand, I'm left-handed, I write with my left hand, I do everything backwards, and, and I think it's okay, but so I say to, to uh, students and free guitar campers and everything that do it in any speed you like, just go for it. But when it comes to arpeggios, you need to get it right from the start to practice slowly. Uh, it's kind of stupid to, to start at the warp speed. You know. uh, it's very tempting, but you need to get all the right uh, notes first. So if we start in B minor. Playing the same note is actually part of the trick uh, that makes it uh, cool. This is a six tuplet. So try to sweep in any way. Then we can move it uh, to from B, Dorian, to C, Lydian. Um, So two top notes, two bottom notes, and then So, but basically these are the ones and to get a good flow. And it's good to practice with not so much distortion uh, because it, it's getting really messy uh, if you use too much. Uh, uh, so, so you can do it, but the basic structure is okay, arpeggio.